and the couples are ready to go. Judges are recalling six. Here we go, competitors. Your first dance. Cha cha. All right, we're going to go down to number three, 19. This is Ivan and Kinsia. And take a closer look at this couple. Very strong, yeah. masculine. Yes. Yeah, I thought they were from New Jersey, but maybe they moved. I believe they have. But I like very strong man-woman partnership there. Strong enough to move into that final. Be we'll see. One. We got to look at all the couples a little bit more. Tihan and Yana from California, a newer partnership as well. I'm very confident. I think they're happy to make this top 12. Yana and Taiki. Uh, and here we have Vlad and Annie, Connecticut. They've had great results lately and really improving. Right he there. made it. <laughs> Thank you, competitors. And up until that moment, they were looking extremely strong, but definitely could have hit a rhinestone. I think yeah, after a happens. few rounds, you know, yeah. smooth, and we've had a couple rounds of Latin, and it's time for a floor you can sweep. see You can see sparkles on the floor. Mary, have you ever fallen during a competition? I've never fallen in a competition, but I, well, I, take really? that, I take that back. I take that back. Murphy's Law. <laughs> When I was uh, representing Austria, I had the biggest fall of my life. The first time their country saw who I, <laughs> I was representing them. Congratulations. It was, it was televised as well. <laughs> and of course, I let out a big scream because I could see both yeah. of my feet in front of my face. <laughs> I fell one time twice in the same dance. Ooh, this Never couple been looks so good. They are from Canada. No, that's Nikita that's and Nadezhda the, from New Jersey. Oh, they're yeah. from New Jersey. Yeah. They've wow. had great results over in Europe lately. Very strong couple, and I know they they're going to be pushing strong. for the final. Whoa. We have Artur and Anastasia, another couple I think we're going to see in the final. I love their style, it's different from all the other couples. Very fluid and flexible. And that's why we have 13 or so judges out there tonight, because I'm, I'm not a fan of his style. Oh, uh, really? I see. I love him. Yeah. Like she's classy and grounded. He, she is classy. And he's he very avant-garde and abstract. Yeah. Past the point yeah. of good line. Now here we have Pasha and Daniela. Just and turned pro Shava. recently. Won uh, Blackpool Rising Star Professional Latin. And uh, they're, a, they're uh, going to be a, a top contender success. tonight. I think so too. Ladies and gentlemen. Again, their style is almost understated. Very, very clean, very clear. They don't go with a lot of over-the-top tricks or trying to, you know, overdance, but just always slick, on balance, very, very clear.
Oh, what an exciting song but that was. And we're going to slow things down for the beautiful romantic rumba. And Lacey's couples once again. Rumba. Easy place. Sasha, California. A lot of bling going on there. Yeah, they're looking good tonight. Very clear. It's right interesting now they're with this couple because they seem to fluctuate in their their marks from competition to competition. Yeah, I haven't seen them for a while, and then recently seen them in a couple competitions. So maybe they took some time off to work on choreography and styling, but looking very strong now. Alex and Loretta. I think we'll be seeing them in the final tonight. Where are they originally from, Jonathan? Uh, you know, he's from Russia, and I believe she's from one of those satellite countries near there. <laughs> Sorry, Loretta, somewhere there. Maybe Lithuania. for me. I haven't seen that before. Yeah, no, they're U.S. finalists and a very, very solid couple. So now we go to the Paso Doble. So we said yesterday, the man's dance. And Lisa's doubles once again. Possibly. Possibly. Oh, we're going to take a good look at Sasha and Cheyenne. They are from Utah. That's right, and I'd say beautiful dress from Cheyenne. Yeah, absolutely spectacular. Their whole look, their performance tonight has been amazing. I've seen them have some slightly off nights this year, but tonight they seem to have pulled it all together. Very strong shaping. Yep, he's a very strong guy, very commanding. And she's very flexible and is great on the end of his arm. To note, the Pasa Doble is the only dance where you know exactly what the timing and song is going to be. There's two or three Pasos they play, whereas in the other four dances, you know the rhythm, but you have no idea what song it's going to be, or sometimes there's little breaks in it. But Pasa Doble, you always know how it is. Well, you hope so, anyways. Yeah. <laughs> Unless you go to Blackpool. <laughs> Here we have, that's right, Michaela and Anastasia, who... Um, at this point, I would say could be our winners tonight, depending on yeah. One thing's how they for dance. Sure, they are always consistent, and they've been winning so many competitions. That's right. Thank you, competitors. I think they are the ones to beat. Very fast, very slick. Cheyenne's dress, that is a dress. Yeah. <laughs> There's probably 80,000 rhinestones on that. That's right. Dress. And does that make it really heavy, Mary? You know, to be honest with you, it's heavy if, when you hold it on a hanger. 
but the second you put it on Ladies your body, of course you're carrying an extra weight around, you absolutely don't feel it. Of this professional international Latin championship. Let's, Let's give a great round of applause once again to these 12, 12 semifinalists. You know, as viewers, we're sitting here and going, all right, let's see the next dance. But as dancers, they're going, oh, just a few more seconds to breathe. For their final dance in the semifinal round, the jive. And music, please. Of course, the most energetic dance of all is the jive. Pasha and Daniela. Great rhythms in their body. Great speed changes, playing with the timing in each other. Yeah, I love their dive, actually. Look at the speed of her swivels. If you want to work out, jive is the one to do it in. Yeah. If you were to dance a dive for an entire hour, I can't even imagine how many calories that would be. Probably be closer to 1,500, maybe 2,000 calories if you did a dive for the entire hour. Okay. Here's Richard and Laura from Canada. Again, another beautiful dress. Run out of gas just a little bit, but uh, certainly amazing dancers. That's right. There we go. We'll see six of those couples back for the final later tonight. Talk about an exciting competition. I'm so happy though that they're going to actually call seven dancers back.